What's happening YouTube boy Tech Tricks back now the video and today we are looking at the DreamBot Z10 Pro. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. If you want to get one of these, I'll link this down below. Make sure to hit that like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. And let's go ahead and show you what this thing can do. Basically, this is a robot vacuum and mop that is auto emptying. So that'd be cool. Um, we've seen different Dream Tech robot vacuums in this channel, but this one is a little bit different and I'd say hopefully it's better. So let's go ahead and open it up. Here we go. Oh, the charging base and the uh, auto emptying base there. Let's take it out of their plastics. There you go. So with the Z10, it has three buttons up here. Power button, the home button, and also the tracking button right there. There's also the LiDAR sensors over here. On the back here, you can lift this. So you can empty this for yourself. Or you can use the base instead. So maybe you just have to clean it or something like that once in a while. There you go. But to clean it as well, all you need to do is just pull this out and then nice and easy. This part opens up as well, like so. And you'll be good to go. Put it back like that. It also comes with a little brush right there. If you want to cut some hair from uh, the brushes and also take off some dust with the brush, you can do that as well. Here as well on the bottom here has the brush part right here where you could take off as well if you wanted to clean that part out. There you go, nice and easy. You take that out to put it back again very easy like so and you put the cover back on and you're done up here is the wheels also the charging station right there some lights as well this part right here you just install that down here like so right there again there's a bunch of sensors and lights down here and then this new this is a new part right here where this is where the vacuum the base vacuum will suck out dirt right there and then to install the mopping system all you need to do is just click it on and you're good to go this is the mopping bottom there you could take off the little cloth there as well by just going through the grooves there and then if you want to refill the water all you need to do is just open that up and you'll be good to go. To release it from the base, all you need to do is click the two buttons on the side. Really easy. And you're good to go. Now the front of vacuum also has a bumping uh, area there. So if it does hit a wall or something like that, most likely it won't though. Because of my experience with Dream Tech, it just swerves around the wall instead of like hitting it. But if it does and it hits something, then you'll be able to see it there. Look at base now here it says these holes where it sucks out the dirt from the vacuum um, the bottom part is black I believe this has sensor home sensors right there so that when the vacuum comes in it'll detect that up here a little trash can you can just lift this up right here a little bag right here uh, all compostable as well so you just have to lift that up right there and you'll be good to go I like how it closes it up when you lift it and then as soon as you Right there, it does open it up. Pretty cool. To put it back is real easy as well. Put it through the grooves there, and you're done. The bag can also carry up to 65 days of dirt. It also comes with the back part right here where you can curl your cord in if you have excess cord. Now this is what it looks like once you've set it up. Really easy, really cool design as well. Now we're just gonna plug it in and set it up on the app. First thing we'll do is we'll download the Xiaomi Home app. Once it's already, go ahead and open up, register an account there, and then we're gonna add a device. Once you've clicked add a device, go ahead and look for the robot vacuum and look for the DreamTech Z10 Pro. The next thing is we're gonna connect to the Wi-Fi and we need 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi. It's not gonna work on the 5.0 gigahertz Wi-Fi. And then we're gonna go and connect to our DreamTech vacuum directly and once we've done that we're gonna go and hit next 
and then it'll connect that to our router now the next steps are just really setting up the device you can name it to whatever you want and you can put it on whatever uh, bedroom or room you want it and then once it's all good let's get started here you're gonna see the, all the functionalities that the dreambot z10 pro can do uh, first thing before you do um, use the vacuum make sure you take out all the clutters at home and um, so that nothing can get caught for the most part it is pretty good it will do a little map here as you could see i'll show you later on the final product here you can even put a no-go zones so that um, you can put it around areas that you don't want the vacuum to go to and once you're ready to go let's get started my first initial impression of this is really cool because it does a 3d mapping as you could see there and then it does the lines as well of where it went that's pretty good it also has a swerving mechanism where it'll go around little things like on the floor so that's pretty good as well now this one has a better suction ability as well with the turbo is more powerful than the dream tech l10 pro so that's a good addition as well good job dream tech that you've improved that stay tuned as well we're gonna do a full review of this uh six months after so that i can show you guys what it actually feels like to have this for a few months after it's done cleaning now you can go ahead and edit the map and add rooms into it you can also add zones into it so that you can be specific more on what's going on in your house and you'll be able to see it clearly as well these are the settings on the dream tech z10 pro as well there's a device settings here where it has a few things that you can use for example 3d high precision obstacle avoidance there's also the voice and volume where you can change the volume of the vacuum I like how it's also multilingual, right? There's also the carpet boost. So when it does hit a carpet, it does feel that it'll have that more, more of a boost during the carpet side. And if it does go to the floor side, it'll go back to its normal state. You can also enable child lock so that your children won't touch the buttons. There's also the resume cleaning mode and also the do not disturb mode, which you, you can change the time as well. There's also the auto emptying settings where you can change how many times the auto empty will suck out dirt from the vacuum itself. I just put it in one, sometimes two, it doesn't matter. So it's really up to you. There, You can also schedule when you want the vacuum to clean and mop in a certain time of the day. I also put it as uh, 2 a.m. Uh, every other day, so Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. You can also look back on how many times it cleaned in a day. Maybe you're not sure when they last did it. You'll be able to see the cleaning history here as well. Now, of course, there's so many brushes and sensors on the vacuum. So they do have the accessory usage here where it tells you when to clean that filter or when to buy a new bag or something like that so that you can clean this and get your uh, vacuum on top notch shape when it goes down to maybe 50% or lower so there you go and then once you clean it you can also hit the reset button so that you'll be able to uh, reset the remaining time as well now with your phone you'll be able to remote control the vacuum as well so that's really cool and then for some reason you cannot find your robot because it got stuck somewhere in the in the room you'll be able to hit locate my robot and it'll make a sound so that you'll be able to grab it and put it back in the base you can also share this with other friends for example if you have a partner in the house and they want to be able to control this vacuum as well you can invite them and device share that to them I definitely would recommend this for people who are looking for a brand new robot vacuum and you're just tired of just vacuuming yourself and you don't want to mop at the same time. Basically, this will just replace, will automize your, your automate your house and it's just going to make it easy for you. You could do other chores and take care of your children or do other things without even bothering with the vacuum and mopping and everything will be good to go for you guys and i believe this product is uh, worth worth the price i'll link everything down below if you want to get one yourself 
And that's it for today guys, thanks for watching. I hope I was able to help you on your choice on a brand new robot vacuum slash mop with an auto emptying base. If I was able to help you, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. Hit that notification bell as well, so keep down your next videos to come. Hit that like button as well, so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. I hope you guys have a good day, stay grateful. Peace!